What's up friends, welcome back to AR4789 Today, I will try Aerolite in Windows 11 Oh yeah, by the way Aerolite is a hidden visual style that introduced in Windows 8 and used until onwards The look is like the Windows 8 sim but mixed with high contrast sim like Win8 sim plus high contrast sim Previously in one or two years ago, I uploaded a video that I try Aerolite in Windows 10, but it's moved to the My Archive channel. And if you want to watch it, the link on the description. So let's get started. First, you have to search Run or press Win R to open it, and type Resource, and we enter. So we go to Seams and we click Arrow. And yes, we have airline on the on the right here, and it's hidden by default. So, to enabling the airline, you must copy this this arrow to the desktop or the other folder, and right click to search the open with, and yes, and choose the notepad. Yes, this is the search code of the sim and the text of. Error MS styles. We type error light MS styles. Yes, this error light. And we save and close the notepad, and we rename the error sim to error light. And move to the sim. Continue. And yes, this is error light. So we apply it, and it's same like the previous one. But the difference is the corner is not filled with filters, unlike the previous one or arrow in Windows Vista and 7. And the toolbars like the minimize, maximize, and close are very like the Windows 10. It displays the Windows light, and we close the settings. By the way, because Windows 11 have the rounded corners in many area, the arrow light in Windows 11 it's very like the Windows Vista 7 Basic Sim. So Windows Basic in Windows Vista and 7 is doesn't have the transparency, but this error line is have the transparency. To be more like the Windows Basic, you must disabling the transparency. Everybody already knows it, but if you don't know, go to Colors and disable the transparency effect so that the error line become more like the Windows Basic in Vista 7 and also Windows XP Why? Windows XP it doesn't have the transparency effect but you can enable the transparency effect on Windows XP you must download and install the third-party application such as like the true transparency but on the action center we have the line at left corner in my opinion it's very glitchy it's also in speaker area and the Wi-Fi area. Actually, the battery area is too, but in here there is no a uh, battery option. Okay, thanks for watching and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm MD and see you next time at the next videos, maybe in the next week or tomorrow. And bye bye.